Michael Willan dude here. I know you guys got to be getting tired of my uh, blade sharpening videos, but uh, unfortunately, that's when I usually have to, time to set the camera up. I move so fast out in the field, it's hard to capitalize footage. But I got some work ahead of me. These are blades off my BX2380 tractor. I usually don't use the mid mount mower, but it was raining today. And um, I had some big fields to knock out. And as you see, they have a lot of rocks. So usually I use either brush cutter or the mid mount for the tractor for the simple fact that you don't want to use your nice um, your nice mowers and your nice decks and abandoned fields. And you can see exactly why. So I have some work ahead of me for these. All right, let's get it done. how they look after you fix them before you put on the uh, finish grinder so I'm gonna do these blades these three fabricate them completely and I'm gonna sharpen these along with all my blades from last week
That's it. That's 14 minutes a day on sharpening blades. I'm probably going to speed up the middle section of that. You guys have seen me sharpen blades enough times where I don't think it has to be in real time. But it's 14 minutes a day, and that's with me having to do extra fabrication to these Kubota blades. To show you how they look now compared to earlier, I've uh, put some new edges on them. Not looking good, but unfortunately, the only time I use the boulder to cut is when I'm doing the abandoned fields. Uh, usually, I use the bush hog, but sometimes you'd have to use the mid mount, especially if you have other properties you're trying to do that day and can't get another stand on over with you. So, I expect those blades to get chewed up again. That's kind of what you got there for. All right, any questions? Take it easy. Let me know. Uh, leave comments below. Obviously, my words are tired. I've been out in the rain all day cutting, but had to get done. Take it easy. Peace.